I'm officially 30 weeks pregnant today and y'all I'm done. I'm done. I am done. Checked out. All set. Girl. Yep. Yep. So let's get into what's going on with me and mini me because this is a mini Chelsea right here. She y'all the attitude on this little girl already and she's not even here. Let me tell you. So <coughs> let's get caught up because I did take a little break off of social media other than YouTube. Um, but we need to get caught up because a lot's happened and I don't even know when the last pregnancy update I posted was. Was it 27, 28 weeks? I don't know. It hasn't been that long, but we do have a lot to talk about because I feel like since the third trimester hit, I have been going through it. I'm going to need to take a lot of water breaks. I know this says Duncan, but I promise you it's H2O. There's water in here. Um, because I'm battling either allergies or another sinus infection. Um, on top of being, <laughs> on top of being pregnant, y'all. This is this this. Oh God, I'm going through it. All right. So first and foremost, my last my last appointment that I think I updated you guys on was October 14th, and that was what was that? My 20. That was a Monday, and I believe that's. Yes, that was my 28 week appointment, like whatever. We did a checkup, everything was good, baby girl was fine, I was fine, blood pressure was good, all of that. I'm still yet to, get, to gain even 10 pounds during this pregnancy, which I don't get it because she's huge. How have I not gained even 10 pounds yet? I'm all baby. My doctor just keeps telling me. He goes, you're just all baby. You haven't really gained weight anywhere else other than like, like I'm all belly is what I should say. Anyway, hold a minute. Um, mind you at my doctor's appointment last week, I went in on Tuesday and I was exactly 29 weeks pregnant. I was measuring 32, 32 weeks pregnant. Girl, my doctor looked at me and he said, oh, you're going to have another big baby on your hands. I said, I know if y'all don't know, if you guys are new around here, my last, my, my son, my beautiful five-year-old baby who's in kindergarten. He's like, yeah, nine pounds, 14 ounces. That's how much he was. He was nine pounds and 14 ounces. And the doctor said, don't be surprised. She's another, she gonna be another big baby. You gonna have another big baby. I said, I know. I, I know, I know. I sound ridiculous. I am so sorry. Um, so I have to go next week, um, a week from today for my 31 week checkup. We have not started my non-stress test yet for my diabetes, but I believe we, we start that when I start my weekly appointments, um, which will be in the next couple weeks. Um, and I still need to get my Rogam shot, which is for my, because I'm RH negative. Um, I have, I believe I have the whooping cough vaccine coming up too. They said it's around 32 weeks that you get it. Um, but I'm getting seen at my 31 week checkup. And obviously if I have another bi-weekly after that, they'll either do it at 33 weeks or they'll do it next week at 31. I don't know. But... I'm uncomfortable. Um, back pain all the time. Pelvic pressure and pelvic pain. Um, I, half the time I can't even walk. And if I do anything, like if I even if I'm up standing and cleaning for like even like an hour, I'm girl, I'm out. I'm out. Um, and she's dropped. She's dropped. But I did write out my birth plan, and then my hospital bag for baby girl is packed. And I'm actually gonna do that. For, I'm gonna do that video for you guys today. I don't know if you guys are going to get that video today. You might get it tomorrow, but my hospital bag for a baby girl is packed and it just makes everything so realistic. And just the fact, like, let me, let me tell you guys, 
the way that my doctor's office does things, and I think a lot of doctor's offices actually do this, when you're a gestational diabetic, they don't let you go, like you don't see 40 weeks pregnant. I don't see 40, 40 weeks pregnant with my doctor, um, with my pregnancies, because it, babies get bigger faster with diabetes. I get induced between 38 and 39 weeks pregnant. So let me remind you guys, I'm 30 weeks today. I have eight or nine weeks until my induction. We haven't talked about that yet, but I have eight or nine weeks until my induction. That's if baby girl doesn't decide to come before that. I am in the single digits to meeting my daughter. What? I can't. I can't. I can't, I can't. Where did the time go? Where did time go? Anyway, that was it. That was it. That's that's what's been happening. That hurt. Do y'all hear that Christmas bulb? I'm hurting. Send help. I can barely move. Okay, guys. We're gonna do a what's in my hospital bag for my daughter. Um, I will do a whole what's in my hospital bag for me. I'm not done yet. I'm not done that yet. But I am currently 30 weeks pregnant. It's 30 weeks pregnant today. I'm out of breath. I'm sorry. Um, if you guys haven't seen my pregnancy, up, pregnancy update yet, that's already uploaded. I uploaded that yesterday. But you guys are seeing the same outfit, the same, like, scenery because I'm filming these in the same day. Anyway, I am 30 weeks pregnant. And as of my last doctor's appointment, my doctor said, she's very, very low. We don't think I'm going to even make it to my induction date. The reason I have an induction date, if you guys are new here, I have gestational diabetes and my doctor's office, as well as I think a lot of other doctor's offices, they don't let me go past 39 weeks when you're gestational diabetic. My induction for my son, who is now five, um, was at 39 weeks exact. Like the day that I turned 39 weeks was my induction date for my son. Um, he actually ended up breaking my water a couple days before that. So he was born at like 38 and four, 38 and five, something like that. He was born at 38 and four, um, because he was born on a Saturday and then Tuesday was supposed to be my induction date. Anyway, so talking to my doctor and just being 30 weeks in general now, and realize I only, I only have eight or nine weeks until my induction date, but she could come anytime before that. My doctor does not think she's going to hold out until 38, 39 weeks. He said, go ahead and get your, your diaper bag packed because my daughter's very low already. I've started dropping, but dropping at a fast rate. Check my 30, check my 30 week pregnancy update to get all the tea on that. I need some water. I'm sorry. I'm also battling a very bad sinus infection or a um, allergies, I don't know. It's starting to turn like winter here. So I know it says Dunkin', but this cup literally keeps my ice in my water all day. Let's talk about it because I like to talk, I like to talk, I am a talker and this video is already two minutes and 30 seconds long. 